So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. I say that just given the length of the question, it is longer than four lines, which is the typical indicator for me that something is translate word problem. And again, this strategy simply just means that I don't want to read the entire question all the way through without writing down all of the quantitative information and relevant info that relates to that quantitative information with the end goal being that I do not want to have to reread the entire question to understand what's going on. So let's get started and see what we can extract from reading this question. So the question says the total area of a coastal city is 92.1 square miles. So I'm going to say total area equals 92.1 uh, I'll say miles squared because that's what square miles are uh, of which 11.3 square miles is water okay so um, so honestly this total area is 11.3 miles squared water plus and let me just get my calculator out 92.1 minus 11.3 is 80.8, .8. so plus 80.8 .8 square miles, I'm assuming land, but I can always adjust that if I need to, in case I'm wrong. If the city had a population of 621,000 people in the year 2010, all right, so 2010 was 621,000 people, which of the following is closest to the population density in people per square mile of land area? So very important line here in people per square mile of land area, because guess what? We already found the land area and we know the people. So if we want people per, right? And I'll just write this down so we can see it clearly. People per square mile land area. Well, how many people do we have in 2010? Well, we have 621,000. Per means divided by, so I'm just going to put my divided by line or fraction, fraction line there. Square mile land area, well, we knew that that is this number here, so 80.8 .8 square miles. And I think that's all they want us to do, right? So I'm just going to go straight to my calculator. Again, my unit here is people. Go to my calculator and type in 621,000 divided by 80.8. .8, and what I get is 7,685.64, basically people per square mile land area. And then I look at the answer choices. The question does say which of the following is closest, so we're not looking for an exact number. So therefore, the correct answer here must be choice B at 7,690.